Zoe, hi YouTube friends. Right, this is going to be a magazine harvest because um, I haven't done any extra videos for a really long time and I've been meaning to, but life is busy. Busy, busy, busy. So I thought we'd come on and we're going to cut up Woman magazine. I don't usually get a lot out of um, this because it has quite a lot of stars and things in it, but I do have a reserve magazine um, Which I will surprise you with if we have time because you know me a camera only lasts for 30 minutes So let's get on with this uh, So woman, let's see what we can chop up today Oh, that's cute with all the uh, um, All the little toys isn't it, but I'm not going to need any toys. Let's make Christmas. This is an old one because <laughs> it's very Christmassy. Um, but I can, it's okay because I can put stock away for Christmas. Oh, I love um, Holly Willoughby. She's so lovely. Nope, nothing is jumping out there. Right. I will show you both pages. So if anything, you can have a little read while we're going along. So what have I been up to um, yesterday, which I try not to spoil too much for um, when I do my, I hate it when I um, um, <laughs> just excuse it, I think it's my natural go to, um, um, it's a bit like duh, <laughs> um, yeah, exactly, uh, yesterday, right, try not to ruin it for the journal so much, uh, but I went to, Rachel took me to this, uh, like, like a discounts food type place um and it has like all out of um out of date food which sounds lovely doesn't it um, <laughs> but, um it's you know because if it's like crisps and tins and things you know and it's really cheap i'm gonna go for it so i we went to have a look to see how out of date things were and some of it was not really out of date at all some of it wasn't even out of date it had like a month to go um some was like it just gone um so like a month ago i really wish i could stop umming <laughs> i'm not finding much in this magazine uh yeah so it it was like maybe just like a couple of weeks out a day or some of it was quite old though there was I love what are they called uh, graham crackers, and we cannot get um, graham crackers here unless you go to American like type shops, like American food shops, and because they're imports, they are so so expensive. Um, not much luck with this, am I? And um, I mean they're ridiculous. Like if you get pop tarts. They're like about five ninety nine a box or six ninety nine a box, which is really really ridiculous. And um, I know that in B and M, is it B and M? Yeah, B and M. You can get them for about two pound, which is quite good because I think in the states they're about two dollars fifty or two dollars thirty five, something like that. So um, it's quite good. That's quite a good price. But you can only get boring flavors like strawberry or chocolate just no I'm not interested in strawberry or chocolate this is not very good this um so um I think where was I going with this oh yeah graham crackers <laughs> got graham crackers now they were pretty out of date um so but they were 25p for a box so I thought right for 25p, I'm going to give this a whirl to see if they're alright. We haven't opened them yet. I'm going to try that later. If they're no good, then obviously it's not the end of the world. I also got, because uh, they have loads of American goods, so obviously because they're buying them in for these American shops, uh, they, um, they probably don't have a very long shelf life and then obviously these American shops can't sell them anymore so then they go to this store so there was tons there was like Butterfingers oh I love Butterfingers only 50p um what else was there at the moment it's come look at the magazine rather than <laughs> cutting up the magazine <laughs> Uh, yeah, um, yeah, I love Butterfingers. There was loads and loads of things like Reese's and Hershey's and all sorts of stuff. 
Um, I may, mainly managed to pick up sort of like more crisps and things like big packets of the oh, what are they called um, I don't know but they're good with tea and they are expensive in here I think they're hold on I'll grab one bear with me oh I have to get a stool <laughs> it's turning into a show and tell those am I going to get it in there they're called <laughs> I'm trying to not move the camera that's a T Y R R E L L S. Turles. This is like roast chicken. And I only just went. So that's like, look, 19th of March, 18. So they've like literally just gone out. And that was like 50p. And in Sainsbury's, they're £2. So that is a well bargain. They also had like ginormous bag of popcorn huge huge for um and it's like the flavored one it was this uh, apple vinegar one and it was 25 pence i got this korean <laughs> no it wasn't korean it was um from thailand um lychee juice drink in cans um 12 cans for three pounds oh i love a bargain love a bargain so yeah i really really good yesterday i think i've got some more stuff as well but i'll save it for when i do my journal video because i don't want to ruin it too much and i'll show you the picture i took a picture of it all together this is not this is not great this magazine i'm not finding much oh look i do like the roast potatoes <laughs> so far that's all I, you're probably shouting out there's things you like but it's got to be applicable to my journal so um Red pepper and sun-dried tomato nut roast. Sounds interesting, doesn't it? Gotta love a roast potato. Oh. I don't know why I don't just do them all the time. I generally do them around Christmas and stuff. But um, I should just eat roast potatoes all the time, shouldn't I? Although we're healthy eating at the moment. So uh, we're trying to have good meals and whatnot and I'm quite happy because I wanted to lose seven pound because that's what I put on and I've managed to lose four pounds so far so it's pretty good just by no bread and no really bad foods or anything so and I'm uh, doing my sit-ups which is um painful <laughs> I get to about 12 and then to get to the 15, because I'm just doing 15 at the moment. When that's comfortable, I'll jump up to 20. But, um, go <laughs> Get to 12, and it's so painful. It, oh, it's a nightmare. But hopefully I'll be, be up, back up to where it's comfortable, and, you know, I'll carry on with it. Because I feel like it's working, because um, my pyjama bottoms feel quite loose. <laughs> That's how you tell these things when your pajama bottoms are loose. <laughs> oh, I just um, want my clothes to be comfortable because when I put that half a stone on, um, it just doesn't feel comfortable. My clothes just feel they all feel a bit tight, and I don't want to have to go buy a new wardrobe. Do I want that watchy thing there? It's quite pretty, isn't it? And there's nothing over it. Kind of like the mask as well. Let's have that, shall we? Ah, oh dear. So, I hope everybody is well. Oh, Zoe, you sent me the most fabulous video um, on YouTube. Um, just absolutely fabulous video of um, Zoe's husband um, translating Texan talk, which was so, so amusing. Oh, I really, really, really enjoyed it. Can't wait to go see Zoe. Um, popped into town yesterday. And just did my normal walk about. So Jared dropped me, because he has to go to his um, his box that has all his uh, stock in. And it's over by Asda. So he dropped me over Asda and I went to Pound Stretcher. 
which was all right. I got one of those um, reedy things, you know, the smelly reedy things. And that was a strawberries and cream flavour. I've put it in the downstairs toilet. So now all the downstairs toilet smells like strawberries and cream, which is confusing. <laughs> Perfect, tasty cream crumble cheese. Shame like the little things are in front of it. If it was just a clear shot of it, it'd be really good. Anything here? Monopoly, Game of Thrones. Ooh, I think Sally would like that. I don't know if she'd play Monopoly though. I kind of like that world there, that globe. I don't use a cafeteria, so it's not much point me having that one. Might have the record player as well. Okay, we're getting a few little bits and bobs. As I said, the, the woman magazine is not fantastic. Um, I will have a double flip through in case when I was chatting and telling you about my goodies I missed something, but I don't think it was that fantastic. I think you're really enjoying me just cutting things. <laughs> oh dear. Right, that in the tray. Rubbish over there. What do we got? So there wasn't anything fantastic on the other side that I've just cut up. <gasps> Lego Batman? Who doesn't love Lego Batman? No idea where I'd use him. How in my day-to-day -day life will Lego Batman come in available? <laughs> Just like, yeah, why not? Anything on those before I bin them? Just have a little look. Christmas gift guide. No, 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 no. Um, ah, oh, fussy cut him later. Is that a dad? No. Um, fussy cut him later. He's um, a bit technical to do at the moment while we're on. Do I want that record player? It's not a very exciting record player and it's on a slant. There's a strange horsey unicorn there. Not interested in that. Oh, and a tinky. <gasps> it's a Teletubby. Dun, dun, dun. I was really surprised. I was watching um, Holly Vlogs and oh. Oh, I'll tell you about that in a minute. Um, Holly vlogs and um, sh no, it wasn't. I'm lying to you completely. What was I watching? Oh, I was watching Big Bang Theory. That was a bit different, wasn't it? And um, they, the um, oh, I don't know what she's called. The blonde one who's married to Harold. Um, she has had some babies. I'm a bit out of date, actually. I keep coming in. I've missed quite a lot of the new series. Well, anyway, she was watching Bob the Builder, and I didn't even know. In America, the You've Got Bob the Builder, which was a little fascinating. <laughs> um, but I wondered, wonder if any of my American friends can tell me, does Bob have an English voice? Because here, it's Neil Morrissey, who's one of our English actors. It's his voice, and I very much like him. But I wonder if it has travelled across the Bob the Builder there, has now got an American accent... I'd be really interested to know and so would my husband because we had a whole discussion on that one we hope that you've still got Neil Morris's voice because why would you need to change it into American I mean we both speak the same language slightly different on some of the stuff um, as we all know um, is it the weekend yet should we go with that yeah we'll have that one um, so yeah let me know in the comments, please. And I'm sure some of my lovely American friends will definitely comment. <laughs> I can I can picture a few. Um, right, is it the weekend yet? Not that I ever want the weekend to come, to, because that's when I go to work. So I'm quite happy with the weekdays, thank you very much. But we'll have it anyway. Right, this. I saw this. This. Um, it's a instant camera with 10 shots, 69.99 at Argos. I was quite interested in having one of these for um, my journal, but I think the, the ugh, brain not switched on. The film is probably really expensive. I think I looked it up, and I think it's as much as like printer ink, which is about 30, 40 quid. Hmm, I would. I think I would still like them. Although I want an all singing, dancing camera for when I go see you, Zoe. Because, um, not this one, because this wouldn't be any good. Um, I want one that 
can take really good long videos and have lots of storage uh, because obviously when we do our road trip and stuff I'm going to want to should I keep that bit? Oh, I'll go around it <laughs> um, I want to be able to record lovely long ones and um, my lovely YouTube viewers might even get some sort of interesting um, interesting road trip video which would be something nice to look forward to wouldn't it lovely viewers I like this unicorn I don't really want the cable in it I might have to chop her off there it's still alright isn't it um, I'll just I'll trim it down later let's just get the general thing I did actually quite like this border it's quite an interesting border but I don't know if I can be bothered with cutting all that off and some Christmas presents it's quite, I quite like that I'm going to put that over in my Christmas section because um, I like the pair of scissors so if I cut this like here like that and up like that da, 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 da. I've also been watching this I might have to um, link her below because I can't remember her surname or whatever her channel's called yeah see that's quite good because you've got all the bits and you can put it as a background or something so yeah we'll have that um do i want the merry christmas box oh i'm, I'm getting the hang of this now we're seeing things right, make sure there's nothing on that bit before i throw it away no i don't want vr okay move those out of the way and we rubbish there should have should have bought a little tub or something to put my rubbish in um, what was I saying? <laughs> it's like when you go upstairs and you forget while you're up there. Uh, oh yeah, Kate. I've been watching Kate and she is um, an English YouTuber. Try and link her below. And she does the pound shop and home bargains and stuff. But she's been doing some car boots as well. And, um, oh, Elizabeth, you're like her. She's she's interesting. Um, so, yeah, I will try and remember to link. Um, but <laughs> I find her really amusing because she does a mug of the day. Um, Kate, <clears throat> if you're watching this, I don't think you probably are because she I subscribed to her and she subscribed to me, but I think it was more on a... I um, can't think of the word more on a sort of um like a, you know a, what is it called no words have just dropped out of my head <laughs> and i had a cup of tea with caffeine in this morning you would have thought that would make it work look how lovely that christmas tree is i think i'm gonna have to have that christmas tree um what did she do it on she just did it to be kind but i can't think of a word that you know just did it courtesy that's it she did it out of courtesy i imagine now if i'm completely wrong kate and you are there hello mug of the day <laughs> oh my goodness kate i can't stop blowing saying it it's driving me insane um but i do love you i think it's so funny right if you haven't worked out she starts her videos familiarity is really nice in videos isn't it and she starts her day with um mug of the day um which she's picked up a mug from charity shop or pound shop or you know somewhere she's picked up a mug and they're always like oh sorry um nice interesting mugs so oh, i want that house but i want that bauble Let's see i like that gingerbread house but I like that bauble. Right. Are we going to be able to get both? Let me see. No, we're not. <laughs> um, I'm going to go for... Well, I've already snip snipped that one, haven't I? So let's go with the bauble. <laughs> um... Yeah, she um, gets these interesting mugs and she comes on and she goes, Mother Day, and tells you about the mug and where she got it from. 
and then she tells you what she's wearing and where that's from because she's facing the camera unlike me i could tell you what i'm wearing um <laughs> and how much it costs if you like but you're not gonna see it you can see a sleeve <laughs> so it won't make much sense to you um so it is the season to be jolly -la 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 -la. um yeah no i don't want any more on that one I don't need that Christmas tree. So yeah, she she generally she gets oh she gets some bargains. I think she got like a calf kids and dress for like twenty five p or something ridiculous like that off a car boot, and I just you know it's just lovely. And she showed showed the dress. Um, can you believe we're at twenty minutes already? God, it goes time flies when you're snippy snipping and chatting away. Um, so yeah go check out her channel and you can have a look around car boots and you know sometimes she oh she does a weekend vlog as well of what she's up to i sort of would like to do a vlog um a couple of things put me off one i like i could do a vlog at home because obviously i'd be more um i wouldn't be so embarrassed at home because at the moment it's kind of embarrassing going out and talking to your camera i think if i was out with a friend like if we went back to that wholesale food rachel and i well it was really dark in that i think they're um they're conserving energy by not putting the lights on because i imagine they don't make a lot of money and it's in like a sort of storagey warehousey thing so i think they were conserving conserving the money by not putting the lights on so and i uh recently um i'm not very good in low light i can't see very well at all so i was like practically blind in there um so yeah i didn't i don't think my camera would be very good in there but yeah if i was out with rachie and we were somewhere um we could i could probably do that because it looked like i was just talking to rachel but I think out by myself at the moment, I haven't got the confidence. Like, I wouldn't go around the works or something, because there'd be tons of people in there. So at home, yeah, I could probably chat to you like I'm doing now. I suppose this is vloggy, isn't it? But I don't like facing the camera. Um, because when I watch it back, I pull faces. <laughs> it looks so silly. Oh, just, I don't know. I'm very... It's, rational i suppose and um i pull faces and it looks a bit daft plus i'm not the prettiest crayon in the box so i figure this side of the camera to see my hands look i noticed that some some videos um they have beautiful manicured fingernails i do not because look how old my fingers look um because I do a lot of housework and I do a lot of cleaning and nails don't survive. I mean, that one's not too bad. Well, it's not really, is it? Um, yeah, it doesn't survive. I I do housework. I'm a proper woman. I ain't got nail time and to be able to make that all pretty. So you really, hopefully, you're not coming on to look at my nails. Hopefully, you're coming on to look at the craft and the pretty pictures and stuff Ooh, i'll tell you what this is gonna be an idea later on if i've got enough to talk about kind of really fancy beans on toast now um why well, say beans on toast <gasps> beans on jacket potato mm, not eating bread at the moment at all I, yeah if i've got enough to witter on about i could come on and make some of the card thingies couldn't i with you there mm. I got some really nice sticker packs that I'm going to show you at some point. Um, but I oh, I don't know if it's a bit of a spoiler for Zoe because... Mm, mm, although she could always like switch off. But yeah, I ought to show you, especially if you're in England because you'd probably like this bargain. Now, do I want to cut up the banana and Weetabix? I have the feeling that I do want to cut up the banana and Weetabix because... Um, that's like going on in my life at the moment <laughs> so that can come out all right i think we might actually make it to the end of this magazine 
can't speak too soon now. Probably won't make it for the card one because uh, I'm going to have to re-charge um, my camera and stuff to for it all to, to work again. Now, do I want any of this food? Am I likely to eat a butternut squash and chilli risotto? No, unless I brought it out because it's not something I cook. I kind of like these pretty, pretty rosies, rosies, roses here. Queen Elizabeth roses. Oh, how lovely! Super darling. They can go in there. Roast chicken. Ah. Eight ways to distress yourself. Give our relaxation tips a go and enjoy your calmest Christmas to date. Oh, I like the sleeping picture. Savour your sleep. Not a problem. Where have you? Oh, sorry, I'm not showing you anything. I don't know if actually the whole of this video you've actually been seeing anything because I'm just like cutting away and chatting away. If anything else, you can just uh, listen to me waffling away at you. I kind of want the camper van. Don't know why. I haven't even got a camper anymore, but I like a camper van. It's a nice one. I have to fussy cut these afterwards. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's nice. Oh, Santa. <laughs> Just peeking out there. Mm, dear. Mm. Lapland for Christmas. Only if you're going to remortgage the house. Oh, it's very, 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 very expensive, <laughs> Lapland. Hmm. Do I want any of that? No, he's not a very good wolfy picture. Well, he's a husky, but he's not great. So, what we got here? Howard's End. Blimey, really? Let's come back, is it? And Children in Need. This is a very old one. <laughs> Nigella. Ah, oh, I love Nigella as well. Ooh, comfortable slacks. <laughs> what have we got? No and no right that's the it bring on the ball balls um no nothing i want there so yeah i've done that and then what i do is i stick all the rubbish inside <laughs> like that pretty 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 just gonna go i've just um hold on I've just done that now haven't i right just want to go flip through quickly make sure i didn't miss anything while i was yabbering at you guys no, I don't think there was anything interesting. It's all the stars. I don't really need. Oh, Megan. Look, she's doing her shopping. She's been to Walmart. <laughs> oh, yeah, we'll have that wedding coming up soon. There was a programme on that the other night. I think, no, I think she's having a quiet one. Do, do, do. No, no. No, sorry for making anyone sick. But no, I think I think that is it on this one. That's not great. So I'm going to go find myself a coffee, really, because I think I need to wake up and have a nice coffee. So, oh, isn't that nice? Horrible colour, though. Absolutely vile. Um, don't do mustard. I look like I've got jaundice if I wear mustard. So, yes, that was good. That fit in my 30 minutes. So... If you've liked this, please like, feel free to subscribe and comment and uh, answer my questions. <laughs> Bob the Builder, has he got an American accent? Right, take care everyone, hope you all have a fantastic week. Toodaloo!